my YouTube channel uh, in the previous months, I have uh, several series of the videos uh, introduce uh, multiple uh, the architecture or EA or modeling tools, uh, including the Archimate tool uh, for the Archisurance, Archimetal, uh, the Protege uh, uh, tool for the Pizza O, uh, and also I have some video to introduce the Spark systems, uh, as well as uh, some uh, the developing language. Uh, and uh, uh, also, I have a few uh, existing videos uh, talking about uh, the topic which I, I want to bring today. So, essential enterprise architecture tool. Uh, this is our tool uh, that I uh, have a chance to uh, adopt the its uh, open source edition for uh, almost one year. Uh, and I, I built some uh, the uh, those uh, yeah, the repository and the models uh, for uh, my uh, working company uh, and within the team is uh, we have uh, uh, trial trial run some uh, the practice uh, the portals uh, views and also uh, we also did some uh, the customization uh, using this tool. Uh, so it's a very uh, the interesting tool. Uh, so uh, I would like to uh, use today as our series, uh, the first video uh, at code 001 to as our opening and the introduction to uh, start some uh, more systematic way uh, to introduce uh, the uh, essential uh, enterprise architecture as a tool. Uh, and also, uh, I would like to uh, adopt uh, the again, uh, the one by one, the chapter by chapter of this uh, essential tools uh, university documentation uh, and uh, make some uh, the learning again so that uh, I can uh, have some more the understanding of that. So, if you are uh, interested uh, on the uh, architecture tool, especially EA tool, or, or if you are using some other EA tools uh, in your company uh, during your working experience, uh, it uh, uh, will be a good uh, the chance uh, for you to learn uh, what is the essential tool. Uh, and uh, you can get chance uh, through my serious uh, practice uh, to compare with your hands-on tool. Uh, it's not means uh, this tool um, uh, can uh, fully replace what you are using uh, on hand, uh, but I, I would like to see the fully potential for using this tool, uh, making our repository for your enterprise architecture team as well as for your uh, company uh, as our enterprise uh, target. Uh, so uh, uh, it's maybe our uh, the several uh, the, uh, the these uh, uh, the dozens of the videos. Uh, I, I will try to bring that uh, from the uh, set up the environment and then configuration in your uh, the open source edition on your machine and uh, if possible uh, I will demo to you is uh, how to make some sample uh, the architecture repository build uh, from some uh, which we can get uh, uh, openly uh, in the uh, the, uh, the websites uh, from the different sources uh, and then uh, we can try uh, how to populate uh, uh, your repository to the variable purpose. Uh, so uh, that is, uh, I hope uh, it will be our uh, exciting journey for myself as our relearning uh, after one year's uh, the, uh, experience, uh, uh, actual practice uh, to use this tool. Uh, and I also hope this can be your uh, the uh, good experience uh, to, if you uh, don't know these two before, uh, no worry. So uh, through this video, I hope to introduce this uh, to you uh, and also uh, have your interest after you learn uh, step by step together with me and uh, to see uh, how this can uh, support you uh, in some of your uh, working aspects. Uh, so before we um, move to the uh, introduction on this tool, uh, I would like to 
to show you uh, this picture. Uh, so uh, if you uh, are working in the enterprise architecture field or industry, uh, this uh, year the Gardner Repo uh, published this uh, uh, magic uh, quadrant uh, should be familiar uh, to you. Uh, the right part is the 2022nd year. Uh, the uh, left part is the uh, just the 2023rd year uh, just passed. Uh, so even we are now moving to 2024. Uh, so. Uh, I hope you have a new year first, uh, but uh, you can see uh, many tools. Uh, I hope is, uh, you must be familiar with uh, some of them uh, and you have used uh, uh, some of them uh, as well on uh, either your uh, real uh, working practice or for yourself. Uh, uh, but the enterprise architecture solution, uh, which uh, uh, the two name is the essential we introduce here. It's an essential project from the open source uh, uh, aspect. All we call that is enterprise uh, uh, architecture solution. Uh, in short, it's EAS. Uh, our uh, stay here uh, and uh, also stay here uh, in the past year. Uh, again, uh, for last two years, uh, these two is the only one within this uh, visionary uh, uh, this uh, 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 this area and uh, it's not the leader uh, uh, here so if you use the sum of those like uh, uh, the, those names are listed here you can see in the leader uh, part uh, the, the tool is uh, also getting themselves is uh, some change, uh, but enterprise uh, architecture solution tool uh, is uh, still uh, the only one in the visionary compared to the niche or the challenger. Uh, and year after year, as you can see, is uh, getting closer to move to the leader uh, area. Uh, I hope is uh, uh, they are also. Uh, even I, my arrow is uh, from right to left, but uh, the position is uh, getting the most uh, right. So if you come to more right, uh, it's getting more uh, leadership, uh, uh, the area. Uh, and also uh, you can see here is the competitive, uh, competitiveness of vision. So it's getting better and also it's getting higher is on the ability to execute. Uh, so. Uh, compared to 2022 is uh, getting better in the com competition parts. Uh, here you, uh, you cannot see the uh, Archi tool, which I introduced uh, quite a lot uh, in the other video. Uh, that is, has the reason because uh, the Gardener only collect uh, the commercial, uh, the, uh, the tool which you can buy uh, or you can get from the mar open market uh, into their research repo. So uh, Archi tool or Archimate modeling tool uh, is our purely uh, the open source tool, so uh, they, uh, it is not listed here. Uh, but uh, if you got the chance to learn my another video about Archi tool, so you may uh, get yourself a feeling for that. Uh, so for our video uh, here, like uh, we are will introduce the enterprise architect solution, uh, the product uh, which called is the uh, essential uh, the project. So if I come to the introduction is uh, uh, you uh, you may uh, uh, have chance to go to this uh, website so enterprise-architecture.org from here you can uh, read yourself about what uh, is the essential project uh, so uh, I, I don't bring those uh, marketing words to you but uh, in short uh, the essential uh, the project is our uh, enterprise uh, mar uh, architecture tool uh, starting from the open source edition uh, several years before and then re in the recent years uh, they also uh, starting to have the uh, beyond the open source and they introduced the cloud uh, and also if you want to host uh, on-prem you get the docker uh, the edition possibility as well 
so, uh, but uh, even they uh, they sell in the open market with the cloud and Docker edition, uh, with the commercial pricing. Uh, you can read from their part. Uh, you still have chance to use the open source uh, the edition, and uh, these companies still give are quite good uh, the supporting. Uh, to the open source uh, edition uh, through their uh, active uh, uh, the community or forum. Uh, so within uh, my video in the following uh, the records, uh, I, I will show you how to use the uh, open source edition uh, to uh, through the download. Uh, in the next video, we can touch base on that and also uh, to talk about how to introduce. But most in, uh, importantly, is, uh, we will use uh, this tool uh, once we uh, configure uh, completely uh, to pop, uh, to build up our uh, repository uh, because uh, as an architect uh, you should treat your artifacts as, uh, gathered from multiple sources uh, to build your repository and then you use your repository uh, again and again to serve the variable uh, the request from your stakeholder and to uh, learn their uh, story and use your repository to uh, show uh, the different relationship within the uh, different areas and different layers, the different uh, uh, the EA, uh, the, uh, the elements, uh, and then populate uh, the, uh, the nice view uh, to serve the uh, decision making uh, or the decision discussing. Uh, the cycle. Uh, so that is the uh, of, uh, the uh, practice I I would like to uh, share with you. Uh, and uh, uh, before that, uh, before closing, I think is uh, I hope you uh, you got chance to come to their website uh, to learn some uh, background uh, of this uh, product uh, first. Uh, and uh, they have a very nice uh, essential university. So if you click that, you will get uh, to this uh, uh, documentation. Uh, so from here, is, uh, uh, we can read is, uh, the meta model. We can read how to populate the views and how, uh, how to deal with the open source. So this part will be uh, our key, uh, uh, the dealing with uh, areas uh, when they set up our environment. Then. Uh, we will gradually to introduce uh, uh, the usage uh, of uh, essential. I try to follow the uh, key uh, the chapters uh, in the university, but uh, primarily is uh, I want to use uh, some uh, uh, the existing uh, the like is the business capability model. We build that, and then is uh, we through that we can gradually is uh, adding more and more uh, the layers in the meta model. Then. Uh, to uh, make some sample uh, the uh, artif uh, artifacts uh, build up within the essential. Uh, how to do that? Uh, I will introduce that uh, later. Uh, and then uh, just before closing, is I want to show you is uh, what's the uh, the scale uh, that these two. Uh, so this is the prodigy. Uh, so uh, we have uh, used this uh, for uh, last years, uh, uh, almost one year. So you can see here uh, the populate. Uh, the matrix uh, roughly here is uh, uh, within uh, the w one year is uh, uh, almost is uh, we have uh, uh, created uh, the uh, the uh, the eight uh, eight hundred direct class um, nearly two thousand slots. What's the slots? Uh, I will introduce that later. Uh, and uh, under those classes, uh, we have uh, more than uh, twenty six thousand uh, instances uh, already. Uh, so that is the uh, quite uh, uh, easily you will start to uh, manage our big scale uh, of your uh, enterprise architecture uh, repository. Uh, and until now, uh, these are uh, quite uh, smooth, uh, smoothly usage. Uh, and I hope is uh, we uh, will build up some sample project altogether. Uh, and through this uh, project, we can start to utilize the meta model here uh, and to build uh, some meaningful uh, the, the models and the artifacts uh, altogether. Uh, so uh, as uh, uh, our uh, summary, so I hope is, uh, you will be uh, uh, 
uh, eager to uh, to see uh, what this uh, essential means uh, and uh, that also I'm very happy to uh, try to uh, document this and through this uh, uh, the record uh, videos uh, and uh, in uh, in the repository so here uh, uh, within my uh, the github uh, the name uh, I have created REA uh, the uh, this uh, project Within this uh, project, uh, there's our essential EA uh, folder uh, created. Uh, so if you come to here, is uh, I will start to uh, load and uh, save uh, the in, uh, information related to, for the essential project uh, in this uh, folder uh, related to enterprise architecture. And I already put some reference of uh, videos with uh, in the past uh, I have published uh, in uh, YouTube uh, for some tiny uh, discussion and also uh, some issue reporting to the uh, community. Uh, so uh, there's uh, some uh, thing that you can uh, learn or you can watch uh, already first uh, and I will uh, starting to upload those uh, this uh, series of videos uh, to uh, YouTube so that later on you can also uh, get the live link uh, to have a watch and the learning uh, and I uh, also hope is uh, to get your feedback uh, and also suggestions uh, if any areas uh, uh, I haven't uh, explained uh, in uh, correct way or in uh, enough uh, detail level uh, then uh, let's uh, exchange ideas uh, to ensure we uh, are learning this essential tool uh, all together and uh, if you have the experiences I also would be uh, very happy to learn from you as well uh, so uh, that's the uh, Oh, for this uh, first uh, video, uh, I uh, I will uh, start to move to the next video for the tool uh, and the platform setup. Uh, see you then. Bye.